Kanye West hosted a chaotic listening party following the Super Bowl which saw him lower ticket prices last minute, despite dozens of fans shelling out $350 to see the controversial star. The performance at a new unnamed tent venue on the Las Vegas Strip resembled an underground rave and was organized just 24 hours before. Exclusive video footage obtained by the U.S. Sun also shows fights breaking out between fans as drinks were hurled, punches were thrown and partygoers were escorted out by security. Kanye was joined on stage by 10-year-old daughter Northwest and rapper Ty Dollar Sign as they danced along to their new album, Vultures, in front of thousands of fans. The 46-year-old rapper was supported by his wife Bianca Sensori who was seen in the VIP section. He announced the gig, Build Ye and Friends earlier in the day on Instagram with tickets priced at $350 with an open bar, $750 for a VIP balcony, and $25,000 for a balcony table. But later in the afternoon, the ticket price suddenly dropped to $150, with many fans left feeling cheated having already paid the higher price to see the rapper. Kanye was set to go on stage at 11 p.m. but didn't step out until midnight, and never spoke a word as he danced around with North and guests while his album played. Fan complaints and insider told the U.S. Sun staff were asked to work the event just 24 hours before and the show was pretty unorganized. The main floor of the venue was sectioned off, meaning fans were pendant around the sides and could barely see the stage, as Kanye specifically asked for space. Staff were seen telling guests they could not use professional cameras at the show, while Kanye had a huge team of videographers roaming about getting content. He moved around the stage in all black and a mask to all of his tracks from Vultures, including Paid, Everybody, Back to Me, and Northwest's song Talking. Despite the ticket situation, there were many diehard supporters seen chanting Yeezy and dancing as security was seen escorting VIP guests to different sections. But after the show finished, two big fights broke out and fans were seen being pulled out of the venue. Crowds of people were also seen arguing with security as they struggled to exit the venue without walking a long distance to the other side of the strip. Kim in town one partygoer said, while a lot of loyal fans enjoyed the show, it was disheartening that he never said a single word on stage when the ticket price was so high. It was obvious it was organized very last minute and nobody knew what to expect. It was classic Kanye, I'm surprised he didn't come on at 2am. North was brought on for several tracks before leaving the stage and was likely brought to Vegas by mom Kim Kardashian, who was also in town for the Super Bowl. She was seen partying with sisters Chloe and Kendall along with new beau Odell Beckham Jr. At the Fanatics party at the Marquee Day Club at the Cosmopolitan on Saturday. Although Kim and Odell kept a distance at the event, the U. S. Sun published exclusive photographs of the pair arriving back at the Wynn Hotel after the bash. According to InTouch Weekly, they have been secretly dating each other since July 2023, when they both went to a Hamptons party hosted by billionaire Michael Rubin.